top. Mm. Yep. I want to be the bottom because I would. I'd be fucking that dude so hard if I was the from bottom beneath. Right. If you're a bottom, you're getting boned. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> then I you want to change your answer? Yeah, I want to top. Yeah, you want to be I, top now? I go to top. Sweet, man. Right, Welcome. We'll both be top. Welcome. So we could never fuck each other then, if we're both no. top. No, we could just do the meaty slap of a, like a gay lightsaber duel. I'm okay with that. <laughs> What's up, you guys? Welcome back to Inbox. My name's Mr. Sark. My name's APL. This is the show here on Tim Respawn where we answer and respond to your always bizarre and usually perverted tweets, Facebooks, emails, Tumblrs. Tumblrs. Uh, GeoCities Yahoo accounts. Orkut. Orkut. Nice. Direct messages. Uh, okay, Cupid requests. Uh, JDate. eHarmony.com profile. Shalom's. JDate yeah. Shalom's. Yeah. Uh, that's enough of that. Yeah. Send them down. Yeah, All right. I, fucking, I, I got tired of thinking. Just right to it today. All business. Does it matter? Hmm. Tie? Tie. What is that, Tie? What is that, baby? Is this some kind of code? People, yeah, I feel. We don't know what this means. Yeah. Tie, is this, is this part of. What does this mean? Nothing. You don't, okay, he doesn't write it. All right, here we go. All right. <sighs> Hit me. First question, Andrew M. M. J. Gray. Yep. Andrew Midge Gray. Sark, if you switch bodies with APL, what will be the first thing you would do? APL, same mm. question, but <laughs> vice versa. The old Freaky Friday. Ah, okay, yeah, the Freaky Friday. Uh, so we've we're... answered many variations of this, but uh, never this one, actually, Andrew. That's a yeah. good question. Uh, do you to wanna go? Up. Sure, I could go, what would I do first? So uh, it's my mind, though, so it's still, because ideally I would be myself in your own mind, though, and able to like tap into like your thought processes and all that kind of oh, stuff. But, I, but this, I don't think that's what this is. Nah, I think it's I just think body. Take over my I would psyche. enjoy being super tall. That would be one thing I would do. Yeah. Um, you just like grab things off a high shelf. Yeah. And be like, <laughs> oh, God, I'm like, look how fucking tall I am. That'd probably be one one major thing. Um, I'd probably like really tenderly feel my whole body, like really, just just to just to learn it, because I mean, if I'm gonna be in it, I might as well know every nook and crevice of the thing. Yeah. So. Because this shit is smooth as glass, yeah, man. Yeah. I just I just I run a, lot a of tight feeling. ship. It's like a baboon's ass, but all over, <laughs> pink and reflective and really. Well, I'm I don't kidding. know if it's soft or not, but uh, what would I do? Uh, I, you know what I would do, mm. and this is the f like really off the cuff. First okay. thing I thought of, yeah. I'd go in and play. <laughs> I'd play Counter Strike well. <laughs> Oh yeah? I don't know. Is that mind or body? I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna assume that if I get into your into your body, your muscle memory. It could be. I tried some Counter Strike the other day. It didn't go so well. Actually, yeah, but you. Oh, were you about to try and? No, it wasn't. No, for the first time. Yeah, no, for the first time ever, like really playing CS:GO, it was not that bad. All right. All right. You don't remember to stop and pop, right? All right. Yeah. Stop and pop. Exactly. Gavin Madog. Madu. Madog. He's my dog, my dude. I don't know. Have you guys played Far Cry 3 much? And have you made any kick-ass maps such as custom... Guess my mode. I guess he's... Oh, game. That's supposed to be game mode based. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna read that one more time. And have you made any kick-ass maps such as custom game mode based? I don't mm. know what that means. Or hunting or racing maps. So have we played Far Cry 3 and have we messed with any of the customization? I like that you struggled it? so hard with that question, even though you know the whole time that the answer is just no. You're right, because I haven't touched nope. Far Cry 3 yet. <laughs> All right, our next question comes from Mike Howard. He asks, if you could have any celebrity come and do an inbox, who would it be? Also, will you ever make What Would China Do t-shirts? Which, uh, I'll, I'll answer that one first. Okay. Uh, that was a, in case that makes no sense to you guys, I made, I've made a joke a few times about when, when my, Patriotic sensibilities come into question about yeah. me just being fine. We should just do whatever China whatever does. China's it seems doing. to be working fine for them. Uh, so yeah, I mean, I would. We, there's so many shirt ideas we've had and we've never yeah. really executed. Let's execute on them. Why not? With, yeah, I mean, just start like a yeah. cafe press or some totally. Shit. Yeah, yeah, and not tell Machinima at all, and we'll take the, the direct cut. Yeah. Huh? All right, cut that mm -hmm. part out, Hollywood. Yeah, just cut that. But yeah, we're gonna. Print well, I'm, I'm dead serious. Dude, people will buy fucking anything. Yeah. Yeah. We should all right. do it. Uh, uh, so yeah, Mike, we'll make uh, we'll make T-shirts through all the proper channels yes. someday. 
As for the first part of your question, if you could have any celebrity coming through the inbox, what would you uh, what would you say? So I would go. This is maybe like a. This may sound stupid and cliche, but I would go. I still think Will Ferrell's a fucking comedy genius. Mm. So I would love to have him on just to see just to see how he would. What he would do? I think he would. Uh, I, think, I he'd think he'd be great. I think he'd be hilarious. He's I mean, good at the. I feel like Will Ferrell's over the. I'm like, shut the. Will Ferrell was making people laugh when you weren't even a thought in anyone's mind. People were like, oh, Will Ferrell's not funny anymore. I'm like, Will Ferrell's been funny for enough years that you should have fucking respect for him, even when he does movies that aren't as funny. Anyway. Wow. Yeah, that's what I feel about. I had like an ironic. <laughs> Did you? <laughs> Yeah, the first thing that came to my uh, mind was Carrot Top. <laughs> Just because I felt like it would be a disaster. And we don't have enough like room a, for all the props giant, he needs you know, yeah. for his punchlines. Um, and then the other one was Daniel Day-Lewis. Just so we could drop like a dick and fart, <laughs> some dick and fart shit on that dude and see what That's he did. That's good. Yeah, I don't even, I feel like we'd, he'd kill us or something. <laughs> Yeah, he'd I just mean, calmly pull out a pistol and shoot both of us. Would in the head you and walk out? I don't know uh, if I'd rather fuck a mermaid whose top half is fish <laughs> and bottom half is a person, or the other way around. What do you think, Daniel Day Lewis? <laughs> <laughs> He's just sitting there like I, super I wonder straight. If would, I wonder if you'd feel those. I would have relations yeah. with <laughs> the bottom half fish. I don't, know. I don't even know if he I just can't even see him doing it. it. No, I can't even see him doing it. Wayne Patrick uh, Kieran or Sierran Kelly. What am I? I have seven letters. If you eat me, you will die. Drink me, you will die. I am greater than God and more evil than the devil. What am I? Ooh, oh, a fucking this is riddle. Like a, yeah, this oh. is like a Bilbo versus Gollum. Yeah, this is exciting. Okay, so Fuck, one more see. time. Did uh, you get it all? Uh, yeah, I got it. Seven letters. Um, eat me, drink me. I am greater than uh, God. Oh. Dolphin. <laughs> Dentists. No. Dentists. I don't. No. Vaginas. Uh, Vaginas. Is that seven letters? God damn it! I'm like I'm like Goodwill. Hunting. How are you so good? I'm at like this? Rain Man. Yeah. Vaginas. Yeah, a vagina is greater than God and more evil than the devil at the same time. Yep. Th and if you eat it, you'll die. <laughs> <laughs> or drink it. Depending on when you're how when do you, you're doing it. How do you fucking do that? That's so you're like you are like Rain Man. Just wait. If it has if it's of the AIDSy sort. Yeah. No, that that's Rated a perfect God, answer. Yeah. That's perfect. Vaginas. Subtext wow. AIDSy. Wayne Patrick's gonna have to bring it with a harder question yeah. next time. That uh, that Samia, Samaya, Samia, Hussein. Hmm. How old are you guys? Answer the damn question this time. Sark spoilt my question over a year ago by just hmm. commenting on my surname, Hussein. Go figure. I would never do that. I'm over that though, bitch. You know what? I deserve that. Yeah? I deserve that. You're yeah. gonna take your lumps on this? Um, how old are we? I am, let's see, 954 fortnights. Hmm. Yeah, I'm celebrating my well, 955th fortnight in just a few days. That's gonna be great. Yeah. And I'm about to turn 16, which I'm super excited Congrats. about. Because MTV yeah. contacted me and wanted to do a super sweet 16 thing that they're still doing. Oh my god. Yeah, it's gonna be great. That's so so hot. I know, I'm gonna look great. Uh, David Larson Wallen says, no fap 2013, and it's a question. Too late. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that ship has sailed. There's enough, yeah. well, I'm not Didn't gonna make get it. into it. Let's just say yeah, my that... bedroom is a battleground of... <laughs> Jeez. Used. Yeah. Uh, well, at, at, at some point when it's chronic like this, you just, you end up, there's there's just stuff everywhere. And, you know, you realize you're at a low point when you're using your own sheets from your bed. And what? there's nothing left. <laughs> to dab? Like to dab the, mm. ugh, wow. Or do you just stand up and you're like, <laughs> you just, at this point. Imagine, imagine, uh, yeah. I don't even want to get it's into rough. what you it's imagine. Rough. This is a part of the show where we go right to fire and answer questions fast. We have no breaks in between and we don't talk about our masturbation habits anymore. Thanks, APL. Our first question comes in from Jordan Reese who wants to know if we like dry or wet shave better. Wet I shave? I don't even shave, I just pluck it. Zachary Long wants no taco pizza biatch! Pizza biatch! Connor Van Moheiser wants to know if we like a d girl with a dick or a dude with a... Vagina. Upon reflection, girl with a dick. Yeah. Yep. I think yep. you're right. I think and that's the right choice. And as a guy, I mean, it doesn't matter how sweet that pussal is. You're, it's still a bearded wonder right in front of you, right? Uh, yeah, you're right. And a girl, you're you right. can just turn around, fuck her in the butt. The if back. She, if the she back, let you. Her back vag, as no. I like to call it. Back vag. Yeah. The brown crease. The the poop hatch. 
<laughs> Manny, what well, I want to know if we want unlimited bacon and no video games or unlimited video games and no video games. I don't understand what this question at all. Mean if it's bacon no bacon, games, there's bacon it's games and, and no, no games. games. Yeah. Did you mean games <laughs> and no bacon? Are we willing to sack oh. bacon for our video games? Is right. that what you mean? Yeah, what was this guy's name? Oh, right. What's who is this? Matt? Person. Come on, Matt. Yeah. Oh, proofread this shit. Uh, so. I'm gonna go with bacon and no video games, because at least at the end of that scenario, I've got fucking bacon! Yeah. I've got something. If I go with video games and no video games, then I just gave up everything I earned by answering your weird, what kind of retarded genie would have come out of this lamp? Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's a fucking, it's an amorphous you blob. Have waken, you have wakened me from an endless slumber. I grant you one wish. Would you like endless bacon, but no more games? Or would you like games, unlimited games, and no games? What would you want? You fucking idiot, take the bacon. At least, I'm you, yeah, just you take idiot. the bacon. I failed genie school. All right, hold on, so maybe, maybe he means, what would you rather have, bacon? Me. You know what I'm doing on this episode? Mm -hmm. What? Dropping the. I'm hanging up on it. Hanging yeah. up. All right. Thanks for all your questions, you guys. Like, oh. favorite, and subscribe, because that's what you do on YouTube to badass like us. Except for you, Matt. <laughs> Please just don't subscribe. Jeez. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Don't do that. What would you like? What would you like more, Matt? Would you like to thumbs this video up and have unlimited sex, or would you like to have your mom? <laughs> or no mom. I don't know. <laughs> I can't even match. There's no way to match the stupidity of that question. I need fucking candy. It's impossible. I know what he was getting at. I know. He, he, he was Jesus. He was going down the road. He just didn't get there. Crickety. Last night. Rush. You win, Matt. Well played. Warning. Ensure protective masks are worn during this process as the gas is highly hallucinogenic. It's getting sexually tense in here. Watch, it's actually like a... It's probably super... It's genius. actually a downy, though, that wrote that. <laughs> Matt is actually afflicted with, like... <laughs> I hope not. Multiple I, sclerosis or something. I would feel bad. If no, we, we get a letter from the Make-A-Wish Foundation, I'm gonna be super bummed. Yeah. About that. Like yeah. This. Matt has no arms or legs. <laughs> and and his wish was that you would read this question. Yeah. And all you did was shit on him. Shit on him. He wrote it with his mouth. A quarter of his with head was, was carved off when a logging truck rammed into his family car when he was young. And all he's ever wanted to know is whether you'd like unlimited bacon. <laughs> ever since that day, all he's ever said is would you like unlimited bacon or video games? Or video games and no video games. And finally, <laughs> Finally, got his question in front of a legitimate question answering outlet. That's right. <laughs> and we just shit all over. We did. I feel bad now. Yep. Well, I hope that's not the case, Matt. Oh, well. You win some, you lose some, right? You lose your legs, apparently. Yeah. Or your arms. Have a nice rest of your life, you crippled, you crippled bastard. <laughs>